So economic and social relief measures, Voya, good afternoon to you, is what we're anticipating. What are you hearing? Indeed, uh, Jeremy. Well, uh, from what uh, the statement uh, that was released uh, this morning by the presidency suggests, uh, whatever the president will table before the nation today will have been a product of the consultations that he has been having with a whole range of stakeholders over the past week. So who are they? It is his party, the African National Congress, which had an extended National Working Committee meeting yesterday morning morning before that cabinet meeting. So that, uh, out of that meeting, the ANC said that while it acknowledges and is uh, pleased with what the government has done up until now, everybody agrees that it is simply not enough. Who else did, uh, has the president consulted over the past week? It is organized labor. Among them, the trade union federation, COSATU, which came out of the meeting that it had with him, saying that it believes a, a trillion rand uh, stimulus package is what uh, will go a great deal towards alleviating the suffering that is being felt across the country. But of course, I mean, many people who have looked at that proposal, uh, Kosaku proposal, feel it's way too ambitious considering the tendency of Treasury to be fairly conservative um, and not to really go for such a, a, a very ambitious uh, targets. Uh, the economists that the president uh, consulted with last week um, also feel the same way. So while everybody agrees that it will, it will be some form of a stimulus, the question is how much money will be put on the table. All right. Uh, we don't have an exact time as to when that uh, address takes place tonight, but uh, the moment we have uh, information, we will uh, get it uh, to you. Voyam Vorka, political editor, I'm going to leave it there for the moment.